Ever been married to somebody where you're just not physically happy with them, okay? And it's not because they let themselves go. It's because you settled for somebody that at the time when you got into a relationship, you were happy to have their attention and their validation. And you were happy to have somebody that's, that was halfway attractive to be attracted to you. But you never really set your sights to the stars and you never really quite went after the women that you're super, super attracted to. And then you'll see your partner in these little off moments and you'll catch them from a certain angle and you not really be attracted to them because there's certain things about them that you just, you just don't like. I know what that feels like, but I also know what it feels like to go through this quest where I'm going out several times a week and dating you know women that make me feel nervous that i'm super attracted to you know acting casual acting calm and cool even though i think these women are beautiful and numbing myself to the effect of their beauty so that way when i met the girl that was going to become my wife that it was just another day in the life of benny so by constantly exposing myself to these women that made me feel uncomfortable and going after what i really wanted it put me in the shoes to have the kind of girl that every time I look at her, I'm like, wow. And every time she spends money on her hair, every time she spends money on her nails, every time she goes and gets her brows done, her lashes done or whatever, I'm just like, cool, yeah, wax up the Corvette. I don't got a problem, you know, spending money on her maintenance. And this is the kind of attitude that you should have towards your life partner. You gotta, you gotta make sure that the one that you go after on the front end is the one that is gonna keep you happy forever. Now, there's probably been a couple times in your life where you've tried this, you're like, Benny, yeah, like these chicks just don't like me, I want this but they just don't like me. And you have to understand that all the times in your life that you've tried where you didn't, you weren't that well socialized or you didn't have things that you built up about yourself that you're really proud of. And then you had a habit of negative self-talk in the mind and you didn't know how to clear your mind and, and go step into a date with a, a blank slate, you know, and, and with some charisma and with some confidence, okay? All those times are irrelevant, they're from the past. And if you wanna learn how to do it the right way, you can click on my profile, click the link in my bio. You can join a group of other guys that are going after this same goal, to have the woman by their side that's ride or die, that's a damn hottie, okay? You can join a community of men that are doing that and get coaching from me, and I'm gonna help you do it. I'd love to have you on my team.